What's going on, Rob from my PPC training? And we actually have a request from our buddy Ryan in our Facebook group to make a video on how to use AdWords columns, how to set them up, which ones you should be looking at. So in this video, I'm gonna walk you through exactly which columns you need to be looking at. All right, so you should be logged into your AdWords account and you should be at your home your homepage here inside your campaign that you wanna be in. And this is real simple. Go down to Add Groups. And this is where we're going to choose our first set of columns. And you're just going to want to look at the most important data points. So for me, that's clicks, impression, click through rate, average cost per click, cost, overall cost, average position, number of conversions, cost per conversion, conversion rate. And we're going to add in search impression share. So you go up here to Modify Columns tab, click Modify Columns. Come down to competitive metrics, search impression share, hit apply, and that's going to drop your search impression share here. And then, real quick, each of these columns kind of self-explanatory: how many clicks you get, how many times your ad showed. That's the impressions. Your click-through rate is, um, you know, how many clicks versus the times it showed for impressions. The overall cost that you spent, average position of your ad for this for this ad group or keyword at the keyword level. Conversions, number of leads you got, cost conversion, how much the lead cost you, conversion rate, obviously that's how often it converts percentage wise, and search impression share is basically uh, it's um, you know one to a hundred how many times how much search impression share you're taking up uh, of the so so let's say you have a keyword white label pay per click how many times out of a hundred is your ad showing when someone searches that so 100% search impression share means our ad showing every single time. Now, if you have like 20, 30, 40, it's really low. Your ads are not really showing when someone's searching. So that means you got to up your bids. You're bidding way too low. Okay. So these are the columns that are the most important. At least for, for us, this is what works the best. I mean, there's a lot you can add. We'll go into it here. But these are the main data points that I like to look at. So you have more conversion stuff. I mean, it really is endless, but those are the most, for me at least, the most important when optimizing campaigns, stuff like that. You can do phone calls, impressions, you can create custom columns. There's a lot, but this, just these right here, is all you're going to need to uh, run a, a successful campaign. Now, you need to also come in and do this again at the keyword level inside the ad groups. See, as you can see, I don't have search impression sharing here. You do it once and it should stay, and, that, and that's really it. So let me know if you have any questions in the Facebook group or drop some in the comments in the uh, YouTube video below. Other than that, I'll catch you guys in the next video.